Hello everybody, this is Pastor Cool back again with frame rate issues, as always. And we're on a new world because the last one got griefed by some assholes. Groovy Yay. Muffin, you suck. <laughs> if you're watching this, I hate you. I know it's <laughs> you. And stuff. Do okay. you know? I yeah, I just know? said that I know. Do you know what it feels like loving someone? Be Whoa. This is the first video that has singing in it. No, I'm pretty sure I've sung before. Yep, yeah, you got the song. But can you hear me? They should be able to. Yeah. Fraps, it, Fraps does a Damn pretty it. good job with uh, picking. Uh, uh, you know. I was trying to see if the push to talk thing worked, but apparently not. Uh. Shucks. I don't use it, so I don't know. Shame. Well, I have to, because I use my internal mic, and if I don't, you guys hear the pounding on my keyboard. Yeah, it's probably annoying. Stop that, please. Just kidding. I don't care. Well, how, how are you turning your mic on and off? Just clicking the unmute and mute thing on Skype. That's probably the same as push to talk, isn't it? Yeah, but it's really annoying to have to stop what you're doing, and then press E, and then click um, mute and unmute your mic. Ah... Uh. Okay, this island's a little bigger than I originally ended up. Yeah, it's pretty big. Yeah. That's why I left. It's too big for me, so I need more space. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> um, no, I'm looking for heavy hills, because I want to get emeralds. I think I figured out how to do it now. Extreme yeah, hills, whatever the fuck right. there. See, this is, that's why I wanted to get the city started, because you're immediately looking for emeralds, which have no purpose yet. I'm, I'm actually looking for Absolutely a village. Yeah. But what are emeralds going to get you? Some uh, trades, I guess? You need an iron pick and stuff. I have five iron, three, three diamond, or three diamond, nineteen gold. Either way, though, I think we could actually fill this island with builds. It at least could have roads, and I'm going to die anyway, so... I'm in Tiger Kill. Hills. Um, but if anything, we are a little better off this time. So we have a message board to start off. Uh, the creep, the creep well, killer the finally we... killed a creeper. OMFG. Well, the there's actually board. sick biome. The Taiga Hills here. Yeah. It actually looks pretty cool. Like the there's like a bunch of cool hills. But you guys can pause that if you want to read the rules. I don't know if you want to or not. But there's the rules. Whoops, wrong button. There's the right button. Okay. So, let's uh, stop building some junk. I forgot it's that you were like recording. Axe. My beard. An axe real quick so we can get wood. <laughs> you need to get wood. Well, there's wood and stuff to create an axe, and I'm going to dig up some cobble right now. Yeah, I meant to place some cobble in there. I have a stack of cobble. But, uh... But I'm... I'm thinking probably no th no theme really for builds. I just want to see some good builds. It'd be kind of nice to have a theme because I think themes add a lot, but it does. It adds character and it adds a theme. <laughs> get ready there. Yeah, I, I get it. Uh, I'm going to do what I was doing last time. I just think we should start using different texture packs for different worlds. No. Yes. Texture packs are for demos. All right, there's there's a uh, there's two axes in the communal chest. Yep, David Perry. Why are the jungles so huge? That's what she said. But I do I do kind of want to have a theme for the village. Like like I have an idea. I'm just gonna need a a lot of sand and a lot of rough cut wood to make my idea. And I, I think we're gonna like I do want to do roads. I'm thinking gravel roads because there's really not a whole lot gravel's good for. Arrows. Yeah, but you get a skeleton spawner going, and then all of a sudden. Yeah. It's like that's way more efficient than breaking gravel and stuff. So. It's kind of a toss up, but. I'm just gonna make all this into sticks. 
Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt me. Yeah. And then, uh, when you go adventuring out and stuff, just place torches as you go. Oh, sorry. Well, Wait. break, I wasn't really talking to you, because I'm talking to the people on the island. Okay, good. <laughs> it's, it's basically to start lighting up the spawn island. Come here! Stop running from me, damn it. Oh, I, I didn't know you were talking to me. <laughs> I thought you were talking to someone else. I was like, oh. There you go. Oh, yeah, rough cut wood. Ooh, stack. This is a mangled area. Whoa. I'm in the plains. But I and think it'll be kind of... Is it on hard? hard? Yeah, the server's always on hard. Okay, good. Because I just saw, like, six skeletons <laughs> spawn. I was like, oh, cool. But I think, uh... I think we'll be doing pretty well once we get the spawn lit up. Mm -hmm. And I, I think, basically, be, being that it is an island... Whoa, frame rate issues. Why do I just... I don't know what, what causes it. I just... I'll drop frames. It's so bad. Mine's actually pretty good right now. But starting it was at, like... Oh, I'm, six and now I'm, I'm dropping back down to like six and eight, eight and stuff, yeah. And I'm up at seventy. And right like I, I know it's not a computer issue. I know it's something to do with the server. It's just it's been weird lately. Alright guys, I'm I'm gonna reconvene when the the frames are not dropping like flies. A lot of trees are gonna come down. A lot of trees. Sorry. And we're getting If you there. fall four, it yep, still yep, hurts you, doesn't it? No. It's six. But we got roads going everywhere, and Gamer First, or Spartan Gamer down there, has taken care of a lot of the trees. We started a forest fire, so <laughs> that, that also helped, but he actually cut down, what was it, seven stacks? Fifteen, sir. Fifteen stacks, okay. He cut down a lot and of I'm trees. Going. And he's still going. <laughs> and starving death. But we're getting Here, there. I got apples, I got apples for you. Come here. No, I refuse! And we're back. We got still the roll board. We got some other stuff, but we have cleared out a lot of the forest. Uh, we got really just set up. It's been kind of like uh, three days or something like that. But as you can see, we're starting to get the builds going. Um, we got some decorative trees and stuff. But uh, this is going to be like a tour of the spawn village right now, as is in a sec. We'll show in a sec. Okay, so this is the auction house. Um, basically, it's kind of serving as the enchantment area as well. I uh, don't think upstairs. Yeah, this doesn't have any purpose. It's just kind of there. Um, but anyway, uh, players will come in here and say I pick this column. So I have this section, um, and you'll see each player has like a section. Um, I would put a sign. Which there aren't any. Um, Basically, I'd put a sign up here, like, you know, let's steal this sign so I can do it. Ding. Okay. So I would put, like, um, uh, two dirt. And then, uh, Prozac. Okay. So, two dirt, Prozac. Then I would claim this area for my auction for this week. And other players can come in, and so say somebody else came in, also, I'm Steve, but say somebody else came in and they were like, okay, I want the two dirt, I will trade three cobble, and we'll make it Kaiser. So then, you know, other people would come in, and at the end of the week, I would come back and go, okay, so there's three cobble, this guy is going to give me a dirt, this guy will give me gravel, and then I pick who I want, and then I contact them, we make the trade. Um... Der net downs. Der net downs. Close enough. Someone's outside. Jordo. So that's the auction house. And I think everyone's Steve right now, actually. Um, but if we come over here, we have the blacksmithing and the chest room. Both of these are not permanent. And we had a zombie break down the door, which kind of pisses me off. Um, but basically, the 
chest room. This is like just public chests and stuff, so you'll see they're all kind of... They'll have stuff in them. Um, we'll get to what's underneath this in a second. But if you go upstairs, you can actually go across here, and then this is the furnace room or the blacksmithing area. And I'm curious why there's two missing. Oh, whatever. Um, so that's this. This isn't finished as well. Technically, this barn-looking thing isn't finished either. Um, we still need different materials. But the barn actually sits over top of the communal mine. And down there, there's actually a double spider spawner I've been working on. It's not even close to done. I'll probably do that in a later video. I saw a bone over here. Uh, yeah. Let's see. The hell? Alright. Um, okay. Uh, I've been doing a lot of the roads and stuff. Um, or I'll, I'll at least map them out and somebody else will take care of them. Uh, this here is the this here is the cathedral, which again not done. Uh, right. um, cathedral is not done. It's going to be worked on. That's actually the creeper killer. He's the one who did the auction house as well. Um, the wheat farm I'll get to in a second because there's some more to see underneath. Uh, this here is Gamer Magnet. He uh, he's not actually very, he hasn't been on the server very long, but um, I like his house honestly. The hey look a book, <gasps> it's a readable book, the Bible, the Golden Block, thousands years ago. Wow. Wait a second. <laughs> thousand years ago, when the strange strange holds were young, a great evil came. <laughs> came he was called I Porzat <laughs> and killed all the killed all the nice creeper and Enderman. When killed he would rise from the dead with a grateful knight would rise Hero Brian. He pledged that he would end all evil, but then news came and he had followers. <laughs> Chapter two uh, the, <laughs> the truth that I know uh when Hero Brian found them, he was stabbing in the back by one of his trusted knights, Gamer Magnet, the end. <laughs> I like it. I like that a lot, actually. Uh, but he's been doing some decent work on his house. He, the last time I saw his house, it was empty, so I have no idea what any of these rooms are yet. Um, like, I just know, like, like it was 100% empty. You'd walk in, and it was just an empty area, so. I like this. I actually really, really like that. That is a neat design for a door. I like those. Um, no idea what the hell those are. Everyone's Steve. And he's got like a little porch. Um, but this is uh, what Spawn Village is slowly turning into. It's going to be more and more of a cityscape as I get down to it. Um, whoops, took a screenshot, I think. Yeah, there we go. Um... It's going to turn more into a cityscape as it comes down to it. I just don't have, like, we don't have any uh, stuff, and I wanted to get out the video before it was, like, you know, two months old or something. Um, this here is Jojo Josh's house, and, again, the doors are broken down, and, uh, damn zombies. Um, I really like his house on the inside, actually, like, the way he partitioned it off with the uh, plant matter and stuff. And I, th I think it's kind of funny, but someone pranked him already. Which is, we're not supposed to be doing that yet, but uh, I don't know who did it. There's no sign or anything. I think I'm going to help them clean it out, though. It's just, they put some uh, dirt blocks here and spread it into grass. But, nice house nonetheless. Can't go down that side. Have to go down the side because there's no grass on the stairs on the side. Um, I also don't know if that's something he did or by himself because it... It's not a very big prank, if it was a prank, so I'll have to talk to him about it. Um, on to the next build. Um, and not all the builds are actually houses this round. It's, uh, or this round, this, uh, in this area. Like, right here, this is the log mill. Or the sawmill, I mean. So it's like, it's a tree farm, got some decorative logs. Then you come in, some, again, decorative logs, kind of empty. I like how we did the blade. 
Um, it's just the iron bars cutting into a log. Um, if he was, if he would go more realistic, though, I would put the blade over here against the wall, take this window out, and have the logs going the other way into like a pile over there. The only reason that he can't do that, and I think that's why he did it the way he did it, is yeah, there's a road here, and that wouldn't fare so well. Um, but that was done by Gamers Are First or Spartan Gamer on YouTube, and he also designed up this little ship over here. It's a he said it's like a little trade ship, and it's actually pretty well done. Um, I like that the sails are out and stuff, but the or uh, the sails are up. Um, nothing on the inside, as far as I know, though. Yeah, nothing on the inside. A lot of the stuff here is still kind of like a work in progress state, just because of the way it's uh, run. You know, we, again, every, nothing's really complete. Um, let's see, go this way. You know what, just for the sake of floating around so I don't die. And now I can run and go a little faster and stuff. We don't use creative mode to build at all. Um, this here is Gamers... Or, oh god. We have Gamer Magnet, Gamers Are First, and... Other Gamer... Oh god, I can't remember his name all of a sudden. He's gonna... Man, when he, if he sees this video, he's going to laugh at me. Or, when he sees this video, he's going to... Or, he'll yell at me. But this is actually a pretty decent, like, little house. I like the design with the wood and the cobblestone. And the S&M room. I guess. I don't know. Some people just got home and they're yelling at each other. I don't know. Um, as you can tell, there are a lot of uh, roads mapped out already. They're just not filled in with... Whoa, lag. Like, so, like, you'll see this is dug out and that's dug out. Those are all roads. They just don't have any uh, gravel in them yet, which is... We're getting to it. We are just keep running out of gravel, <coughs> which is uh, kind of unfortunate. All right, let's see here. Uh, oh, the farm. That's the last thing. Well, now I'll talk about what's up and coming. The farm has been breaking those kind of baby going on. Uh, basically, this is all set up to be a, it's going to be a piston farm with uh, ice and everything. So I think that's what he's waiting on right now is to get a silk touch so we can go get ice. And you'll, as far as I know, you're going to stand like right here, push a button, and you'll get pumpkins and watermelons and stuff. Um, so it's going to be a really big farm. Let's see. We've started doing some lights, as I can tell. I don't know who did that, but I like that actually that's a really nice look, like street light and then this here is my plot um, not so much for my house it's uh, my plot for uh, <laughs> the docks like the trade ships and stuff um, basically right here at this sign that's the property line and uh, the property line actually was uh, like right here or something like that but he kind of just started building on it so any forgot what I was saying, <laughs> um, but anyway, <coughs> the uh, property line will cut here. This is all going to be either wood or stone, or wood and stone, one of the two, all the way down to here at the same level as probably one above the water or something like that. Like so, this level right there, I'll put back, um, and get rid of it. Uh, whoops. Then. Uh, That'll have docks going out into the water to, you know, have boats hook up to and stuff like that. Then we have a couple other, like, little things started, like on that peninsula right out there uh, will be a lighthouse. Oops. There. And over there, that little house thing is uh, Sean's house, but again, empty. Not really a point to go all the way over and see it. Uh, oh, hello. What's that? Then I don't know what uh, is going on right here. Alright, let's go find out what's over here. And sorry about that, my mother was changing pillows. I don't know why she had to do it right now. Uh, Liam's plot. Okay, so apparently Liam has claimed a ton of land. Well, not really. He just happened to get lucky with the peninsula. Because... <laughs> There's a road that cuts right there through 
it's like right here that's a road that's a road sharing to here but to heck with it and that's a road so he's getting from like right there to there he's actually got a decent sized area um, we'll see what happens um, overall not a bad build oh, yeah. very very birchy I don't know I think this is a joke right now. Yeah, the shit house. It's a shit house that you get stuck in. Um, but either way, the uh, spawn actually uh, has come out really very, very. I don't want to say drastically different from what I had uh, expected. Um, but it is greatly different than uh, what we've had before. This is definitely one of the best spawns we've had in a while um, and then of course you know it's lit up well it's, it's starting to get lit up well enough to where like we don't have to really worry about spawns and stuff like that um, but you spawn right there on that little block and it sends you in whatever direction but everything's pretty much lit up it gets less lit as you get that way but and like right there, there's some dark patches all over, but like, you know, like right in here is, it's all pretty safe. Um, so, we're getting somewhere. But either way, guys, I don't want this video to be too long, and uh, because it's been a couple of days, I really don't know how long the video actually is, so. And I gotta help find Jordo, help uh, Jordo find a location for his plot. So, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, rate, comment, love it, like it, and as always, guys, I will see you next time. <laughs> Bye. Oh, God. I don't want to be Steve. <laughs>